What Ness at, man? She said she had to study, sir. Look here, boy, come clean. I'm not playing with you. Where my baby at? I'm telling you, she had to study. Hey, Jordan. Boy, if I... Hold on one minute. You hold on, hold on. Yo! Bernie, honey, listen. Jordan is gone. He snuck off to some concert. What? Bernie. Huh? I will tell you how much trouble you in, but I only make me mad at you, geeks. Uncle Bernie. Shut up, don't you talk. Yeah, Bernie, watch out. Hey, man, what are you doing? Yeah, watch where you're going. Pull your pants up and maybe you can walk. What'd you say, old man? Old man? I got you, old man. Oh, man, oh, oh. Hey, man. Hey, come on, man. Come on, man. Clothes for college? Girl, that's in a year. What you need new clothes for now? For the interviews. I can't wear my ratty old clothes. Sure you can. That's how you get student aid. Oh, honey, just give him the credit card. Give him my credit card? Yeah. Give Nessa my credit card? With my name on it? Wanda, what do you think I am? Got it. You can always refill it, you guys. Thank you. Hold on, hold on, Nessa. Uh, I'll be out in a minute. There's a hose on the side of the house. I moved my car out to the street, so your precious driveway is free, okay? Wait, wait, wait. What's up with your pit crew? I and mean, what you promised some boys? Nothing. They boys. They ain't doing all that work for nothing. They're my friends, and they like cars. Once again, they boys. I don't want to tell you what they do like. Believe what you want. They ain't doing out the goodness of their heart, Nessa. They boys. I keep telling you, they boys they ain't got no goodness in their heart. Nessa, you ah! Boy, you <laughs> Don't come up in here pregnant, Clef. Oh, Lord, don't come up in here pregnant. I'll show you better than I can tell you. Get, get knocked. Huh. Sit that baby in the basket in front of somebody that don't ding dong. <clears throat> baby. Watch. 250 is the limit. You got that? Now repeat after me. 250. 250 limit. Bernie, let it go. That's Donna. Thanks. Bye. Well, see, now you got a kiss for that. Hi, but I thought I was the mall. Well, come in here and show us what you got. Ow! Ow! Well, let's see. Oh, is that Prada? One pair of shoes, $250, and she come home with one pair of shoes? America, I don't understand that girl. OK, she got champagne taste. See, that's what happens when people from the hood get a little something. They waste on that bling bling lifestyle. They got no sense at all. Well, I'll tell you what. Those shoes are going back tonight. Huh. We still got time. Damn, man, I got lost a diamond. Hmm. You know, I don't know what you're so mad about. I didn't go over the limit. Hello, how may I help you? Go ahead. I need to return these. Oh, it didn't work out. Let me issue you a store credit. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. Store credit? No, 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 no. These shoes just been bought. They've never been worn. Just put my money back on my credit card and let's pretend like it never happened, which is shitting at. Store credit is just as good as cash. No, it ain't. Well, it's our policy. All right. You're going to pay my money back, Nessa. <laughs> With what? I don't have any money. Oh, OK, Miss Gat Rock. Now you want to try to play broke? You better find a way, because I want my money. Hey, Aunt Wanda, do you want to buy these shoes? First of all, I don't wear secondhand shoes. And second of all, don't play me against your uncle. You were wrong. Thank you, Wanda. <laughs> <clears throat> now, 
back to you, Miss Thang. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go real easy on you. You're gonna pay me $10 a week, promptly, every Saturday. And I'm not playing with you, Nessa. I mean it, I want my money. Fine. 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 I don't have it. What? Nessa, let me break something down for you right quick. If you don't pay your gas bill, they shut your gas off. If you don't pay your light bill, they cut off your electricity. Now, doggone it, you owe me. Now, give me my money. Jeez, I didn't know you needed $10 that badly. America, what's with people owing you money? They get an attitude with you for asking for what's yours. Back in the day, I had a friend who owed me $50. First, he stopped hanging out. Then, when I see him, he acted like I stole something. You know what? Now that I think about it, he still owe me $50. Hey, Fred, I want my money, brother. You owe me. You have been owing me. You still owe me. $10? Three weeks done gone by, Ness, and all you paid me is 10 lousy of doggone dollars? Well, I have a babysitting job in an hour, so you can stop bothering me. Bothering you? Oh, I'm bothering you. Well, I tell you what, Missy, I got news for you. I gonna keep on bothering until you give me back my money. It's a trip. I'm tired of this whole to do. I can get your money. Well, stop sitting in the dark. <sighs> Uncle Bernie, let me put the screws to her. Let me shake her down for you. I passed her anyway. I might as well get some money for it. You know what? You got a good point there. <laughs> I'll take that action. 75 cents to every dollar I collect. 50. 65. Deal. <laughs> you watch me. Hey, Ness, I was babysit. Mm, fine. Well, now you can pay me my money. Oh, yeah. Here you go. Hold on, Ness, what you doing, man? That's my money. No, that's your money. This is my money. Sister, you owe me $250. Actually, it's 220 now. Oh, you want to be slick now. Nah. Only reason I made that deal because you told me you was broke. And I appreciate that. And right now, I'm all caught up. Same time next week? Oh, that's how you gonna be now, huh, Nessa? Hey, you made the deal. <laughs> Don't worry, America. I will get mine. You can't guarantee it. Nobody stand between Bernie Mac and his money. Nobody. Except my agent, manager, IRS. <laughs> oh, hey, America. Bernie Mac is road weary. 12 cities in 14 days, long hours, different hotels every night. I am beat. But one thing traveling does, America, it make you appreciate what's waiting for you at home. Believe me. Uncle Bernie, you're back. We missed you. Boy, I'm busy. Don't come in here. You made those kids a schedule and expect that to work? You just gave them something else to fight about. I didn't know what else to do. They don't listen to me. Wanda, I told you, all you have to do is stand firm, stick to your guns. That's all I do, and it works. That's because they fear you. They better, because if they don't, I'll get Big Mama's belt and I... America, if the problem is that those kids don't fear Wanda, then don't worry, they will. I'll see to it myself. Wanda. Mm hmm? Here, baby, this for you. Ooh, ain't this Big Mama's belt? Mm-hmm. My God, was she a size 40? Oh. It's not for wearing, it's for scaring. Oh. You understand that? You said the kids don't fear, now that's the key. I call this weapon of ass destruction. Uh, thanks, honey, but you know what? The belt, that's not my thing. Oh. That right there is the snap. It's also called a yellow threat level. That's good for domestic disturbance and washing of the dishes, bedtime, and pre-church. Now, if it escalates to the orange threat level, that's when you gotta crack the whip like this guy. Yeah, now, when they see that, they don't wanna see what else gonna happen after that. Now, if you crack that whip like that, only thing, 
You can't complete a sentence. You gotta do things like, boy, I done told you. Next time I tell you, I'm gonna, I grab a lot of Wow, that's very impressive. Of course, when you do it, you get a little flair. I like to stick my tongue out like MJ. Well, if that doesn't work, then what's the next threat level? Oh, the real threat level. You don't want to go there. Because if you do, we'll be on the 5 o'clock news. Now, here you go. And remember. Way to the free for all tonight. Here's a taste of what we'll be serving up. Oh, that's yeah. my song! You're really, really hot. You're well, hot, 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 shaking wet. Hello? Hello? They are very Hot, sweet, sweet, hot, hot, sweet, Hey, now you're gorgeous. Study him up. You hear that, America? Did that sound like studying to you? Doggone girl, she off to some doggone party. Uncle Bernie, I need to go to Dallas to crack the books. I'll crack a book upside her head. Y'all just wait. America, y'all pray for me. <gasps> Three. Woo! Now for my favorite sports show. Sports day. I, I can't what I do? Oh, what? Shut up, stay right there. You two, come on out here right now. Come on, Chop Chop. Who did it? Did what? Yeah, who did what? Oh, you're going to dirty up on me, huh? I got some refreshing memory. Hey, Wanda, come here, baby. Yeah. We did, Uncle Bernie. Please don't let I want to bust our heads. It was an accident. See, we wanted to play video games on your new TV, but then we couldn't figure out how to make it work, so... Here. What? We couldn't get that piece back in. I'm not talking about this. I'm talking about who smashed my new television with this. Come on now, who did it? Come on! Uncle Bernie, we have something to tell you. It Jordan just... did it. What? Oh. He stole my clubs and he smashed your TV. What? That'll teach you. When I tell you to get your book back off the floor, you listen to me. I'm more afraid of you now than I ever was. Well, I guess I won't be needing this. I will. Okay. Yeah. Cold red, Martha. Cold red. Move, move, baby girl. They don't need you running. They don't need you running. Now, you too. That's right, America. I'm taking the power of the belt back. Should have never given up in the first place. I just hope I haven't gotten rusted in my technique while I was away. Yeah, that's why I be hitting him all back here when he be trying to run. Honey! What? Hey, man, would you mind popping us some popcorn uh, with extra butter? A uh, little salt. Anything else? Yeah. Some of that cheesy spray if you got some. Some of that cheese spray if you got it. Some folks don't know when to go home. I'm... What the? Who in the hell bit off this pan and put it back in the basket? Don't make no doggone sit. Look at this. Bit the pan, put it in the basket, garbage all on the floor. Oh, animals. Bunch of doggone animals, you hear me? I'm living with a bunch of animals. You hear what I said? Bunch of doggone animals. Oh my God. Ah! Ah! Let's go see what that is. Ah! Everything cool, man? What's up? No, look. Oh, my dear Lord, what is it? It's a rat. It's a possum. It's ugly. Hey, hey we better get this out of here. Hey, Bernie, where's your gat, man? My what? Your gun. Your, your toolie, man. Your, your piece. Uh, don't tell me you live in this fat and you ain't got no heat up in the house. I ain't got no gat food. This ain't the ghetto. 
Tell that to that big ass rat in this kitchen. This is a custom made floor. You think I'm gonna shoot it up? Y'all got too much damn money. <laughs> okay, it's cut. You sure, baby? Oh, my goodness. What? My man is scared of a little bitty old rat. Oh, he afraid of no rat, man. He just caught me by, by surprise. Oh, oh okay. Because uh, it looked like you were scared. No. Shoot, I'm mad by mine. No, oh, well, get on down then, man. That's all cool. <laughs> there he is! Why are he behind you? <laughs> Quit playing, man. The guy said he's going to relocate him, put him in his natural habitat. You know, he's going to be fine, Jordan. He'll be fine. But guess what? I got a surprise for you. Da da! Wow, a rat! Oh, no, that's a showbiz rat. That rat was on Fear Factor. Wow, thanks, Uncle Bernie. No, I don't know if you can thank me just yet, because I got some rules, Jordan. Rule number one, that rat Jordan stays inside this cage. Rule number two, the cage stays inside your room. I'm not playing with you. And finally, rule number three, the most important rule. Is to have fun with it. Thanks, Uncle Bernie. Thank you too, Jordan. See America. Bernie Mac can be fun. See, I realize I have to ease up on the boy, you know, give him some slack. You know, try to uh Uncle Bernie! Yeah. Have you seen Buster? Jordan! I thought I told you to let that dog go around no cage. I told you not to. The only reason I got it for you, you don't, you don't never do what I tell you to do. Don't go to that thing running around right here. Oh, that's a fuck, I tell you. You don't have any evidence against that girl. Judge, I have my gut, and that's all I need. Your gut doesn't stand up in a court of law. My gut's above the law. See, this is what I'm talking about. A beautiful day. Perfect for a family drive. You don't need no woods. But all you need is an open dog on road. That's all we need. Am I right, kids? Hey, what are you doing? We have to see if Polly the Penguin lives or dies. You know he lives. You know it. You didn't see me 7,500,000 times. No more movies and no more headphones. That's it. You in the top, I want to hear what you're saying. I swear no, to God, everyone. I'm going to drive this car off the cliff, and we're all going to be in hell together. Uh, no, 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 honey. I know what would help. Keep your eyes on the road. <laughs> OK, everybody, I have a song. Here we go. Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a knot? Can you tie them in a boat? Can you throw it over your shoulder like a continental soldier? Do your ears hang low? America, this is crazy. Hey, stop. Stop. Hey. Look at the mess you're making. Stop it. Hey, how's Team Trooper doing? Oh we're, oh, we're doing great. Actually, I think we're having a little bit too much fun here, sister. Someone's peeling, Lord. Kumbaya. Okay, here we go. Bernie, this is for you. Okay. You always hog the remote control, you hog the couch, you hog everything. Who wrote that? Let me see that, let me see that right. Honey, it's about listening. Well, the reason I hog things is because I own every doggone thing. I can hog things if I want to when you own them. Okay, this is also for you. I don't like the way you're always threatening us. I won't threaten you. When last time I threatened you, huh? Huh? Okay, we got another one. You think the world revolves around you? That's bull. That ain't nothing but some bull. Trying to kill my spirits. That's all that is. That's all that, that, that's all that is. Play haters. Okay, look, you have one more. I hate that one cologne you wear. It makes you smell like a horse. <laughs> look, look, look. Who, 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 who wrote it? Give, give me that basket. No. I got some things I want to say. Okay. On the king's so. Man, why are you teasing the girl? I'm trying to teach her a lesson. Well, if you're trying to teach her a lesson, just teach her. 
You know, instead of scheming and plotting, just come direct with her. Look at it, get baby girl all upset. Thank you, Uncle Bernie. You're welcome. Now I know why he's spending an extra day on the road instead of coming straight home. <laughs> what? What? You're intercepting text messages now, huh? I'll tell you something, baby girl. If these white folk wasn't here, I'd break you off a little something. I'm not kidding with you. Mary, I got the boy on track. Now I have to teach that girl to keep her damn mouth shut. Now I got to come straight home. Messed up my tea time. Hello, Mr. Mac. It's all wrong. <laughs> but I go by lemon lime in the industry. Is that right? Yeah, I'm a turntablist. So, so, let me lie. You the kind of cat that got all the kids squirming on the dance floor, right? <clears throat> Mr. Mack, you are the funniest brother in Hollywood. Everything you say is hilarious. Is that right? Is teen pregnancy funny? <laughs> <laughs> Look here, man, I ain't trying to be funny. I'm trying to make a point, man. <laughs> Yo, that's the face. You're doing the face. Hold on, wait, classic. Who you with? <laughs> oh, Mary, this boy has no natural fear. And Wanda tied my hand so I couldn't put it in him. You can't trust somebody who doesn't know when to be afraid. Who you with? <laughs> and I ain't that funny. And action. Days coming, Bernie. Days coming. Who has that? Come on, come on, come and get him! <laughs> Just didn't know who. It was a family secret. Like, ain't Ruth and Aunt Betty. Oh, oh, they let her. Uh, um, mm, mm, mm. Like, like, 